I suppose we're honored to have the opportunity to introduce Joan Weber as this year's recipient of the Gospel Values of Justice and Peace Award. What, what are you doing, Shannon? The extravaganza is tomorrow night. We're not supposed to joke around like this tonight. Who says I'm joking? I mean, have you met Joan Weber? Yeah. She is impossibly kind. She is relentlessly positive and seems to wear her heart on her sleeve. What is she hiding? I, I don't think she's hiding anything. That is who Joan is. Right. Now, Shannon, Joan Weber has been a dedicated servant in youth ministry for over 30 years. Her many ministerial roles have allowed her to share Christ and her love of peace and justice with youth and adults alike. She has taught the justice course for the Certificate in Youth Ministry Studies program and put her beliefs into action through Young Neighbors in Action and collaborations with Catholic Relief Services. Joan is also a familiar face at national conferences like these where she can be seen speaking and leading breakout sessions on themes of peace and justice. All right, well, I mean, that sounds impressive, yeah. but how do you explain this picture? <laughs> Not this picture, but how do you explain this picture? What, what, what's to explain? She is clearly trying to shake these kids down for their lunch money. <laughs> no peace and justice for them. What is the matter with you? Joan Weber lives peace and justice. In fact, the folks who recommended her for this award said the following. Joan is the epitome of a role model. I cannot think of another person more deserving to be recognized in the field of youth ministry than this incredible woman. She is truly a saint among us. And, and referring to the first time that she met Joan, Amy Larson from the Diocese of Cheyenne, Wyoming said, I remember being totally engaged in how she made the gospel come to life. She truly has changed lives by forming those who go out and form others. I know I am just one small example of the difference she has made. There's a quote attributed to St. Francis of Assisi, preach the gospel at all times and when necessary use words. No matter where that quote actually came from, there truly is no person that more exemplifies this statement in Catholic youth ministry today than Joan Weber. Wow. What an incredible servant of God. Have you ever seen her in action? Well, I have. I, we, we spent a whole week in Washington, D.C. working Young Neighbors in Action. Didn't she teach that Youth Ministry Certificate Program class when you took that Peace and Justice class? That was you? <laughs> <laughs> well, I, I'll, I'll admit I, I was wrong. It's, it's truly an honor to be part of this introduction. Congratulations, Joan. So, on behalf of the National Federation for Catholic Youth Ministry, it's my honor to present the Gospel Values of Justice and Peace Award to Joan Weber.